Hello everyone. It's James again. And before I start today's short short video. I just want to quickly say. All work in this video contains 100% original content of and by myself James Smith, otherwise known as Bigood4000, and was uniquely created with normal software, by myself James Smith. As I purchased commercial rights from normal to produce my unique and original video with this software. Commentary is uniquely my own thoughts, feelings, and expressions. Now that I have that out of the way. I do hope your day is going way better than fantastic. And your journey to self-betterment is going way better than fantastic as well. With that being said. I want to keep this video short. You see there have been a few comments that have come in. That made me remember something I thought about a long long time ago. And something every now and again comes into my mind. And that is. What if the narcissist that was in my life. Susie my ex. And the rest of my family. What if they were able to have kept me brainwashed into still being a part of their lives. And to not know anything about narcissism. And this ties in with my last video. With so many people on a societal level believing very big big lies. About life. About society. About nearly everything. I've sat and thought to myself. That could be us. That could be us. Because we might be wrapped up right now. At their house. Or with their fake friends. Spending time doing things that don't matter with people that have no real emotions and no ability to love. And we would be clueless to this fact. Going along like sheep. And likely not only believing their mess. But believing the lies in the world too. Because I think about my old self. Yes. I knew something was wrong. But there was a time. Or in certain spots and areas of certain relationships. I honestly don't know what I was thinking. And I was just going along to be a part of. And that is dangerous. Because when you aren't thinking you can't see and you can't hear. It's like you are in this fake bubble. Or a reality show. But you can't hear the truth about life. And you can't see the downfall happening around you. You can't see evil basically. And I think God showed us through what we went through. What is really happening not only in our lives. But on the world stage. So we don't fall for the lies. And so we don't get scammed in the long long term if you know what I mean. Because that is Satan's job and goal. To roam around seeing who he can devour and destroy through manipulation and sleight of hand. And by overt and covert actions alike. But God let us see. God let us hear. It was and is painful. But he did it because I believe he loves us so. Well that's all I have for today. Again. Short and to the point. With that said. I do hope your day is blessed. And until next time. Bye for now. And be good to yourself.